All right. What kind of nonsense we're getting into today? We're a drywall expert today. It's a new bathroom I put in about two years ago. And this wall has been unfinished for a long time. So we decided we're going to put a little wainscoting up, some new sheetrock. But I noticed I started peeling off the old sheetrock. There's the old plasterboard underneath. If you look, about this, these little dangly things here. They used to mix uh, horse hair in with the, with the plaster back in the day. Give it a little strength some fiber and uh, don't want to focus a little dusty to deal with but it's non toxic anyway and uh, I don't know what's going on here but, uh, gonna give you a little before and after or maybe some progress shots here some old wallpaper there that uh, man that's got to be well the house was built in 1870 the main part over there where the fireplace is this was added on later but age wise it's getting up there whether I come across any names or signatures or something, I know under this wall, my father added a name, his name on there, because his uncle put his name on there when he put the, the new wallpaper up one year. But uh, yeah, and then this stuff is pretty old too. This is even older, obviously. And then this is something my father put on. Eventually, we're going to do this whole room. And it'll look a whole lot, lot better. But uh, I'll give you an update in a few here. Yeah, we're into it now, boys and girls. Got one bag of shite there. Now it'll work. Holy crap. Anyway, just want to let you know this stuff right here, good stuff. I was told by my floor guy, the one that sanded this floor, uh, that's actually red cedar throughout the whole house, even under this rug, but he told me when I was doing this, I still had the, didn't have the sheetrock up in here, and he was telling me that this, this wood right here is uh, uh, black walnut, and that wood right there is pretty expensive. Uh, they used it for framing material back before you know, the two by four days, and um, if I wanted to take that out, some furniture guy would uh, love to have that, or a floor guy, or anybody that's in the um, woodworking, which I happen to know a guy right now, um, out west, Midwest. Um, my wheels are turning on that deal. Uh, but, I just wanted to show you how Nasty this is. Nasty, nasty, nasty. I'm sweating my schnuckers off. I'm only not even half done. Frick. It's all bull. It's all bull. Well, we got that cleaned up. I don't know if I'm going to continue on or not. This is, uh, you know, a lot of work for one guy that don't know what he's doing. and You know. The vacuum I'm using isn't that that big. So I got two bags of shite. Started the third one. I still got all of that to go. Just gonna do this one wall for now. Eventually I'm gonna do the whole room, but the uh <clears throat> I think I'm gonna leave them uh furring strips right up there. If I go down to the uh, walnut, I don't know if it's uh, in and out where I'm going to end up on my trim here. Because these studs are already in that I put in. 
used to be a big uh, big doorway here running up here and down to there and into that room and that was a a den I converted it into a bathroom and laundry room and uh yeah so I had to stud up the wall to make the doorway regular doorway but uh and right where these are I'm not moving them so as long as it's you know fairly level or not bowed at all I'm just gonna drive on and put that new sheet rock right on here behind here put a new trim in because I destroyed that putting that taking that off yeah make sure I got all my nails and shit down try to get that up underneath the crown molding because that's just going to get destroyed taking it down and then putting it back up so yeah we'll move on so that's probably going to be it I don't know I got to take a shower and get work ready for work that's lunch now dick around what is tomorrow I'm going to hit it tomorrow make sure all of this demo is done and then I can just start Put it back together, get some sheetrock. Of course, it's raining out. I don't know. I gotta pick a dry day for that. Um, fuck. All right. So, I guess today I'm a carpenter. Yay. Drywall man. Demo man, actually. Time to take a shower, shave. So, I don't know. Talk to you later.